This is the presentation of quadrilaterals. So first, we're going to take four different sticks and unite them in any way that we like. And here's what we have. What are its characteristics? It has four sides of different lengths, and we have built the most general quadrilateral called the trapezium. Now we'll build another figure just like this first one. But this time, we'll hold the base so that it's flat and parallel to the top. What are its characteristics? It has four sides, and two of them are parallel. We've made a trapezoid. Next, take four sticks made up of two equal pairs. What are its characteristics? It's a quadrilateral. It has two pairs of parallel sides, and its opposite angles are equal. This is a parallelogram. Next, take the same four sticks as we used for the parallelogram, but we're going to join the same colors together. What are its characteristics? It's a quadrilateral. Does it have the same characteristics as a trapezoid? No, it has no parallel sides. Does it have the same characteristics of the common parallelogram? No, it has two pairs of equal sides, but they're adjacent. This is a kite. This time, we're going to build a figure with four sticks of the same color. What are its characteristics? It has two pairs of parallel sides and two pairs of equal angles. This is a rhombus. Now we're going to construct a figure just like our parallelogram. What are its characteristics? It's a quadrilateral. It's a is it a it is a trapezoid. It is a parallelogram. It has two pairs of equal sides and four equal angles. This is a rectangle. Next make a rhombus just like the one we already made. And we can check its right angles. What are its characteristics? It's a quadrilateral. It has four equal sides. It has four equal angles that are right angles. This is a square. <laughs> 